All right, so uh, I wanted to do a quick video on um, the uh, Power Acoustic Mofo. So, see? Bueno. Um, this is the original Digital Designs claw frame. It was also later used by Serwin Vega Mobile for their VMAX series. Um, and that's where I got it from. And uh, it, it uses, uh, the, the Mofo uses a um, two and three eighths coil, which is also used by several other companies like mostly Kicker. Kicker is really popular at that. And um, one of the issues we found when doing the Mofos is that the, the frame is great, but it's kind of inappropriate for that coil. So as you can see, it uses like a nine inch spider. So a nine inch spider and a two and three eighths coil that's, I mean, that's great for a lot of excursion, but the coil really limits the excursion. So it's kind of like when, you know, Wolfram was using the TI frame on that really short motor. So it's kind of a waste, kind of dumb. But uh, this is my version and uh, we've built probably 40 or 50 of these as the Black Eye, not Black Guy, Black Eye series. Uh, basically I use um, a concept cone, I dope uh, the back with epoxy. Um, these are awesome because they play in sealed or ported. Uh, they take about 950 RMS and they play to like 24, 27 Hertz. So they're really good for uh, home theater if you want to use them for that or even just, you know, uh, some sort of car install where you don't have room for a big ported box. You can put them in a sealed box and they'll still play really, really, really low. So these are for Gary in Tucson. Gary, thank you for your patience. Uh, we finally got all of them done, got your T2s done. And uh, I'll probably be having the wife drive down to Tucson to deliver these. Thanks, guys.